Hello all. Today we are going to discuss a very important SAP tutorial. Physical inventory verification process. I have already uploaded one tutorial on the same topic. But uh, I'm just revising this topic. How to <coughs> physical inventory verified in SAP system. Okay. So here you need to fill uh, check what is the process. Okay, physical inventory verification process is comprises of uh, <coughs> three steps. Okay, first you need to create physical inventory document. Then again, it's count inventory and then final posting. Okay, and you must be take care that if the must be done in the same financial month, that is if physical inventory document that is PID is created in the 7th of June then its count entry and posting must be completed by in the same month on the on or before 30th okay so what is the process to check the inventory details of the particular material run transaction code MMB fine uh, I have a, a material code for which uh, I have to need post the uh, inventory difference okay so let's check this in MMB run the transaction code MMBE okay okay this is our material code this is your plant code and this is our storage location I'm just going to post uh, execute this uh, transaction code MMB. Unrestricted start is 167 numbers in main store. Fine. Same I need to just verify with MB52. Okay. Okay. One sixty seven quantity. Fine. One quantity is missing uh, are damaged due to any reason. Okay. So once we have done the physical stock verification, 166 quantity we have found in our storage location, which is presently available for further use in the our company operation. Fine. So once we check the stock available stock quantity is stock is 167 numbers okay at plant 3002 at thousand location fine now we need to execute the second step what is the second step quantity of material may be noted i have noted run mi01 by the user who is having the requisite roles fine so you need to execute the transaction code MI01 for creation of physical inventory document that is PID. Okay. For you need to choose the document date, plant count date, plant date, plant code, storage location and check on the batches with deletion flag. Fine. So I'm just going to execute the transaction code MI01 for the creation of physical inventory document that is our second step mi01 for creation of pid fine so we need to copy the material code here i have just copied this document date current date Plan count date, current date, plan code is this, storage location is this and check on the batches with the deletion flag and you need to click on the enter. Okay. What is the next step? You need to fill the material code for which you are going to post the inventory difference, correct inventory difference. Okay. Just enter the material code and click on the save button to create the physical inventory document okay so I'm just going to uh, fill the same material code copy okay and you need to 
post once i have posted the physical inventory count is created and you need to copy this and document number is for the date is fine so our next step is once the physical inventory document created now use mi04 to create inventory count document enter the document number and fiscal year and press enter fine physical inventory document number and the count date and you need to enter okay enter inventory count okay so what here you have to enter uh, enter the physically verified count of the material and click on the save button i repeat again enter the physically verified count of the material once you physically verified count the material and say get the same approval with the competent authority okay don't post such documents without the approval of the competent authority okay otherwise it's your responsibility dually verification will be done with the uh, one or two uh, two officers of the uh, in officer in charge of your storage location okay i repeat again take the approval first then the posting process is uh, start okay so i'm just going to i'm just going to third enter the inventory count i repeat enter the inventory count enter the the inventory count that is the difference actual count after physical verification okay whatever may be difference in my case one difference is there starting is 167 number okay 167 numbers now one quantity is damaged due to any reason okay one six six okay so i'm just going to copy this document number and going to post mi04 fine mi04 and uh, here you need to fill the physically inventory document number fiscal year and count date okay and you need to click on the enter okay uh one actual physical available count is 166 i have entered here as per sap it is 167 but actual as per after physical verification it is 166 so i'm just going to post count entered by physical inventory document count enter for the physical inventory document fine we have successfully completed completed the third step okay now fourth step what is the fourth step enter the run mi20 to see the list of inventory difference okay run mi20 to see the list of inventory difference so next step is run the mi20 to see the list of inventory difference okay so i'm just going to execute the transaction code mi20 this is the plant location this is storage location this is the physical inventory document okay so i'm just going to execute see 
This is physical inventory document number. This is material code. This is plant code. This is SLOC. This is book quantity. Quantity enter as after the physical verification. Quantity as per SAP record. Difference quantity. This. What is the difference of amount? Is this okay? So we have successfully checked the inventory difference. Okay. Now the next step is use MI zero seven to post the inventory difference. Okay. And this difference should be posted by IFA only. Okay. After the duly approval from the competent authority and finance officer, this step should be done. Okay. So I repeat again with proper approval of the competent authority on note sheet, then you should post this difference. Fine. So I just I'm just going to execute this transaction code MI07 MI07 this is our fiscal inventory document number fiscal year and posting date okay once we we are fifth step is MI07 post difference of inventory okay so physical inventory document numbers and uh, click on the post see the difference in physical inventory document number posted with the document number this okay you just need to note down this document number okay on the same day okay now what is the next step then again run MMB to verify the inventory okay I'm just going to again run the MMBE transaction code MMBE MMBE oh what is our material code you need to copy from here initially it was 167 and we have posted the difference of one quantity okay see now it is 166 in MMB at this plant as this storage location 166 I repeat again 6 after MMBE the quantity of this material is 166 I have successfully posted the difference of one quantity same you need to verify in MB52 also stock verification initially it was 167 and now it is 166 so we have successfully posted the inventory difference okay so hope you understand and follow this process okay thanks for watching this sap tutorial okay due to any mishappening like theft fire and flood or any um, unwanted circumstances maybe your stock is damaged okay then you need to get the approval from the competent authority sir such and such due to such and such reason this is the issue and uh, i need to physical stock verification of this inventory and same is the posted and update in the sap system okay so first you take the approval then follow these steps and you will successfully update the record in sap system okay thanks for watching have a nice day Please share this knowledge with your friends and colleagues because knowledge sharing is very important. Knowledge sharing is gearing. Okay.